Alright, and welcome back to more Bloodlines. When we last left off, we were uh, finishing up a quest for Fat Larry, and we are going to go do two quick things. We're going to go talk to Venus, and then we're going to go check out that hotel and throw a trash can at this guy's face. And you'd think he'd just react to that, but you'd be wrong. Actually, there's a couple things to do in Confession. This could take a little while, but... You know, I think we can actually take care of this and our problem with Miss Jezebel Locke all in one, if we are lucky enough with time. Doing my radio voice for some reason. Alright, oh hey, look at that, it's a lady. Uh this is... She is... She is pure liquid annoying condensed into a human body. Let us begin. I knew you talked to me. Oh, I God. swear, you were all like totally drawn to me. And my I'm paint peeling know. voice. I need all the LA vampires out on the scene. Not a lot of you out tonight, which is weird, because I don't know of any parties going on. Vampires, huh? No, come on. It's totally cool. I'm Patty. Seriously. Everyone knows. I mean, surely you've heard of that annoying lady, oh god, why is she talking to us? Who is this lucky someone? His name is Kent Allen Ryan. He's a Toreador. Really good looking. Dresses really well, like all Prada usually. He abandoned her, you say? I do know him. I saw him recently. You are totally Ah, uh, I'm gonna murder her. No, but seriously, I'm going to, um, I'm gonna just tell her to go fuck off. Um, he went to San Diego for some business deals he had to act fast on. Oh, that is totally fast. So, like that. I better go find him. He needs my help to do any yeah, no problem. Just drive down there. He'll be looking for you. Ugh. That's Patty. God damn it. Sup? Everybody comes in here, Scott, and the short house rules. Inhibition is the first thing to go. Along with apparently anything covering cleavage. I am your beat process, and it's time to confess. And who am I about to have the pleasure of speaking to? Venus was her name, handsome. Got anything you want to confess, love? Larry mentioned me? Larry? Oh, so you're the Action Jackson who was going to send you over? Oh, yeah. I've been waiting for someone like you to come in here. You see, I've got this situation that's gotten a little out of hand, and I need someone to inform some people that they won't be getting paid this month. Intrigued yet. Copious cleavage. I mean, uh, since the minute you started moving your lips. Well, yeah, the parking lot next to the Empire Hotel. A couple of guys, Russian accents, bit big. Why need you to tell them? Venus doesn't have their money. That's it. What's in it for me? Drinks on the house. For a week. I'd prefer cash. You want cash? Whatever, I can do that. The question is, are you worth it? Definitely. I'll do it. Hmm, I expected you'd bite. Oh, hon. Tell them I'm broke. You can run, right? <laughs> Just don't go starting any street fights, alright? These guys are connected. Anyhow, a lot of people have yet to confess to the beat priestess. Later, die. Back in a minute. Alright, well, I'm certain this can't possibly go wrong. I mean, after all, she wouldn't send us to a situation like this without, you know, any... We're gonna get our insides beaten out through whatever orifices are conveniently within fist distance. Okay, so... Well, I'm about ready to have to, uh... We're gonna get there, and uh, hopefully by the time we're done, we won't be shitting teeth. Uh, da -da. Do, 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 do. Prostitute, homeless guy... Ah, boy. Well, this doesn't look like it'll be too, too difficult. Hey, buddy. Confession. Did she send you? That she did. Money. Where is money? Moose and Squirrel. She told me to tell you she doesn't have the money. No money? No. Yes. 
Ah! Oh god, why? I didn't even do anything! Move, hobo man! Oh crap, I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get my ass kicked here. You know, hobo man, you're gonna get me killed here. Get out of my way! Oh god! Look, I don't want to get killed because you're too slow to walk out of the way, hobo man. Oh god. Well, this could get ugly very fast if we don't hide. Uh, Russian Mafia. Okay, well. That was fortunate that we got out of that situation when we did. Because that's actually a very difficult fight, and fighting them is a criminal violation. So... If we had higher persuasion, we could have gotten out of that situation without having to fight them. But as it stands, we uh, did not have high enough persuasion. So, you're gonna get that. Alright, well. That was a time and a half. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Let's go tell Miss Cleavage that we don't that uh, we got everything settled. What? Passed on your message. I can't hear you. That's stuck in my office. I'm not gonna lie. When I didn't have good textures, I was convinced she wasn't wearing pants, and that was hilarious. Anyways, sup? Well, you certainly did better than my bouncer did. Poor dear Fontaine is next to the right anymore. Already had a call from Boris. Wasn't you happy about tonight, son of a bitch? Say. Like Own a club? It's my lifelong dream! When I saw this club, I had to take out a significant loan from a king bastard by the name of Boris, and every time I haven't been able to make the monthly plus interest, the bastard takes what he feels is a suitable late fee. Go on. I've got a club to run, so I'll be blunt. I refuse to fuck that fat misogynistic old man one more time to hold on to the club. So I need someone to eliminate him. Do this, and I'll make you a signing partner. Good as done. He's at the Empire Hotel, always as a few of the fiercest bully boys standing around trying to out sneer each other. He's got a short temper, and more than likely he's been drinking for the last four hours. Here, key to the penthouse level. When I when I get back, we'll talk about our club. Seriously though, like as a Torridor, owning a club is just fantastic. That's like awesome for us. Do -do 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 -do. Hey there, what's going on? Ladies, ladies. And what should we got here? Hey, a wallet! 50 bucks, gotta have that. And... Do -do 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 -do. So we've got two things to do, infinite doors there, that was neat. Uh, we're gonna go to the hotel, we're gonna go kill Boris, and we're also gonna pay one Miss Jezebel Locke a visit. And I'm sure that these will all go over perfectly well with minimal murder involved, and who am I kidding, there's going to be, like, more bloodshed than the St. Valentine's Day Massacre. Skip, skip, skip. do 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 I need a key to her room. I can't do that. It's against hotel policy. I'm an old friend of hers, on a surprise visit. I see. Well, in that case, perhaps I can make an exception. Here's the key to her suite. Have a nice evening. Thanks. See ya. To do, let's take a look at our character sheet, and we might actually want to pump one more point into stamina here, because... Not even kidding, that's going to be really, really useful to have soak bashing for. Alright, well, going to make a quick save here. And when we are 
And we're going to go check out uh, Boris and Jezebel. La la la. La la la. Boris is on the sixth floor, the penthouse suite, as they say. Mm -hmm. We're going to just try to talk our way into there, because really, these guys are pretty tough, and they've all got relatively powerful weapons. Used key. Can we get in here with lockpicking? Probably not, but... Ha! No. Oh, you'd think this would be easier to find. Hey, what's up, buddy? Hasta la vis. Who the hell are you? Your hair is just absolutely ridiculous. Did anyone ever tell you that? I have a private message for Boris from his lady friend. You give me a message. I take to him. I can't, but it's important. He'll be angry if he doesn't get it and will blame you. Very well. Follow me. Ah, boy. Dat hair. Well? Ugh. Who the hell are you? Uh, Venus sent me to dis discuss something with you. Is that right? This would be easier about without your goon hovering over me. You want Pima to leave? Why would I allow that? This could get embarrassing for you. I'm looking out for you, Boris. Okay, okay. It is that bad, Dima. Very well. Happy. I'll spit it out. It is cool. Venus wants the debt wiped, and she wants you out of her life. She believes she has more than paid for it. So, what, you are her messenger boy? You do work for stupid little girl? You are not man. What does that make your guards? I was man enough to get past them. This is too How can we come to agreement? And maybe get you to do something for me instead? No. You will get nothing from me. Go tell that bitch she can pack up little club. Her name is coming off. Get the hell out of here. Vashli, go. Maybe you misheard me. Call off the debt. Now. Hey, right there. Oh, jeez. Dima. Gonna blood heal here. Oh, jeez. Well, this could have gone better, but... Gonna get the Glock out. Alright, well, we could have handled this a lot better, I'm sure. Oh, jeez. Well, um... We're just gonna go ahead and call this a wash. Oh, hey, a fancy ring. More Glock ammo. More Mac-10 ammo. Ow. And we're going to just drain this guy of all the blood we can drain him of. Oh, that's tasty Russian gangster. Well, we're clearly not getting out of here without a fight, so might as well just pop into all the rooms and steal whatever isn't nailed down, because, you know, hey, sometimes that's got to happen. You're going to get that sometimes, you know? <laughs> Ow, nice. Dick. Uh, anything of value in here? You know, I know there's some sort of what of book in here that I can find. Uh, 
blood heal a bit. Ah, oh, jeez, that was rough. Oh god, we might get finaled here if we don't move. Oh jeez, I was hoping this would go a little smoother than it did. See if we can't get into some of these rooms and find anything of use. There's a book. That was what I was looking for. But that's really nothing we can take advantage of, so... Yeah. We need higher finance to be able to deal with that book. But I think we can make it out of here without having to actually fight anything. So, go us. Nope, we're gonna have to kill all the guards. Okay, well, that'll you're gonna get that. Nope. Alright, well, we're gonna go kill the rest of the Mafia people, because I was honestly expecting we didn't have to do that, but it is what it is. And when we're done with all this, we can call it a good day. Oh. Do You get into the ballroom here. Oh god. Alright, I think that should cover everyone we have to fight now. Yep. Alright, well, that was actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. And we're gonna see if while we're in here we can't take care of Jezebel Locke. And after that, I think we'll call this video good, and then we'll return to Venus and get her money. Um, ah, there we go. Room 5. Da -da -da, blood heal. Anything useful in here? Believer, little morsel. Oh, God. Have you come for the kind of enlightenment only Jezebel can give? I take it you're Jezebel Locke. Yes, I am Jezebel. And I have such things to show you. Yeah, knowing that you're crawling with disease, such no. beautiful, dirty little things. You. Won't you come into my parlor? Um, yeah, I'm coming in, and Death's coming in with me. Oh, you cannot escape me, little morsel. Oh, bugging there. One way or another, you and I will intertwine our beings on the way into the meta circle, and I will send you forth. Stop lagging, game. The sweet sickness I carry. Look, I understand that's a thing for some people, but really, no. Oh, great, another cold kook with an attitude problem. Yes. Come no. Join the enlightened. No. Indulging your animal instincts until both kind and kindred lie spent upon the altar. Desire will be our truth. Desire and the death that follows. You're the only sacrifice tonight, Jezebel. This is surprisingly a much easier fight than I've usually had against her. Yeah! Take that, lady. And look at that! A book entitled No Means No. Can you open that chest? No? Oh god, stop bugging, game. Stop lagging. This room is usually considerably laggy. You'd think we could take those prescription bottles, but no. Um... Alright, we're gonna GTFO with this room. Um, there's nothing of value to take, and after that, we are going to uh, talk to one Venus, and that will be that. Alright, well, I hope y'all had a good time watching this one, and we will see each other later. Bye!